I like arm wrestled the next guy and like I, by the second arm wrestle I'm like man like I just want to get this over with like a CBF and I just go put like my max power into it and then my max power basically resulted in a uh, spiral fracture and in the doctor's world fracture and break can mean the same thing so for your context uh, it was fully separated the bone was completely broken Okay, I gotta focus. Anyway, long story short, hospital I initially went to sort of fucked me over a bit. They didn't do a proper job, so I went to a specialist. Had to get a full-on surgery with a nice big long piece of steel in my arm. I can show you guys the scar later if you're curious. But, um, like, there's no, like, I'm gonna be able to do gym and lift whatever I want. Like, there's no problem. Uh, but it's more just d waiting for the correct time to start. He really wants to... Um, so funnily enough... Oh, what are you doing for Funnily enough, tomorrow I actually have a CT scan. So, uh, the CT scan will reveal how well I'm healing. Oh, he's so lucky. Well, they basically said I can arm wrestle if I want, but I said I don't want, like, I don't, like, the thing is, I've never turned them down, because I, I just thought it was, like, innocent fun. Like, I've been doing them since I was a kid, like, I've been doing arm wrestling since I was a kid, it's just fun. Like, I, I don't do it to, like, oh, I want to humiliate this guy or, or something. Oh, okay. Um, like, I've always done it for fun. So with that being said, oh God. with that being said, um, I won't do it anymore. Oh my god. Okay. With that being said, I won't do it anymore. But if anyone really wants to test their strength against me, just come to the gym. We'll do a we'll do a squat. I was doing I was doing 180 for 10 when I when I broke my arm. So, eventually I have to get back to that, but like, if anyone wants to come in the gym, like, we'll do that. Do you have low bone density? No. My, my bone density is fine. People forget there's an entire part of your nervous system designed to stop your muscles breaking your own bones. Muscles are goddamn strong. Correct. I'll give you something to squat on. It's okay, Yumi's already done that. No, I'm sorry! <laughs> I didn't mean it! You can hit me back, just don't tell mom! <laughs> yeah, I've done a hairline fracture to my wrist, it did heal though from cast treatment. If you have a steel rod in your arm, you're supercharged like kick ass. Well, yeah, technically speaking, my arm is stronger, but at the same time, like, people have complications in terms of like. Uh, pain, like, I wouldn't be able to get it on camera, but basically, I can, I can feel my muscles and, like, tendons and ligaments and shit going over the steel. And the feeling is actually, with my, like, part of the surgery, they sort of have to stretch the, oh shit, they have to stretch the nerves a bit. So, I had nerve damage as a complication, and I couldn't feel my arm properly for a long time. Even now, I still have some weird feeling. Um... And one of the complications is like over time you'll feel your your feeling will come back, but essentially, oh, oh God, nice. Uh, your feeling will come back. What are you doing? Nice. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh sick. He's super unlucky. Uh, okay, that was bullshit. Um, in any case, in any case, uh, I can, like, I can actually feel the muscle and ligament go over it. Well, he can hear me back, just don't tell mom. Your movement would be limited. No, my movement is fully back to normal. I'll challenge you to arm wrestle when I see you. I get so many of those jokes. Also, Deoxy, what's up, man? 
Congrats on the baby, by the way. I, I don't think I've actually said it. Oh, that counted as a punish? Oh, well. The committed duck. She's as cute as I am cool. She'll have really good uh, storytelling skills. Oh. Says. Is that Boo Lars? It is. Round three. Yeah, legit. One of the first toys you should give her is an arcade stick. <laughs> that that low key be funny as fuck. Does that break the floor, by the way? I, I don't think I've ever been hit by that on this stage, at least. Start ducking that. If she can't web dash before the edge of two, she's out the door. What cliff style or what? Oh, nice. Good weird punish. Only your only your bloodline can do it. Oh, king wave dash. Not even just normal wave dash. What are you doing? Oh. Oh, I gotta I gotta start ducking that string. He's just spamming it. I don't care, brother. Fucking knew it. Now, nah, well, I've just been, I've been extremely lucky with my recovery. My physio has been really good. Um, I've been taking supplements as as I have researched to help, done a lot of I've done a lot of physio, a lot of lot of rehab. I'll show you guys the scar in a sec. If anyone wants to see, if you're not good with scars, don't look. Uh, for the skin, I was taking, I was not taking, I was applying a vitamin E one. A vitamin E, uh, oil. That helped with the scar when it was initially really bad. I basically don't need a tattoo anymore, that's the reality. Oh, come on. Electric even got fucked up there. Start ducking that, man. Oh, the jab actually works there. Cheap. Um, but also just help with the bone healing, like, 
uh, some calcium supplements. A lot of a lot of vitamin C's helps as well. Was it a horrible accident or carpal tunnel? Yeah, I'm okay now. It was uh, it, it was caused by a, an arm wrestling incident. Tom Foolery. I was AFK. Oh my god. Rewind the vibe. We have technology. Oh. Oh my god. Now you just need a chest scar for chest wrestling? Chest wrestling just sounds like a sex position. <laughs> what about giving coaching? I've had a couple people ask and I'm, and I'm open to it. But um... I don't know, I'd have to have some sort of like organized system for it. I haven't researched that much. I'm wrestling though injury that was unexpected. Yeah, no, nah, dude. The guy, the guy, my surgeon basically showed me a video of another client he had that actually got the same injury as me. Oh, nice. Oh, he just went for it. I guess that's low risk because most Mishimas don't punish shit. Ah, uh, I, I was trying to do three. I want you to saw my Ling and Fundies. I don't know, uh, Jumpy, if you have a gameplay, you're gonna send it to me. You're gonna send me the gameplay. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I didn't know it was sort of down to that level. Oh, what are you doing? Look at the fucking damage on that, by the way. Um, if you have some gameplay that you want me to, like, look at in particular, maybe just upload it to YouTube as, like, an unlisted video, and then you can uh, send it to me on Discord. Just send it to me on Discord, and then uh, I'll, I'll look at it and give a rundown as best I can. I, again, I don't play like the Tekken 8 Xiaoyu, so it might not be optimal, but at least from a fundamental standpoint, I can do my best to help. Oh, it's a fucking high. For Tekken King, a three game win streak only counts you 600 points but a losing streak is 800? Oh my god. Oh, so you actually get punished for losing streak. You do coaching. Uh, I've had people ask, so, but it's not official. It's not official, but I, I, I'm open to helping people if they ask, like, directly through stream. If I have a lot of people, like, I'd be willing to open something up for people to, uh, like, request it. Once a blues and above losses in general lose 10% then uh, okay, I see. I see. Okay, I see. I see. Oh wait, this is Wi-Fi. Ooh! Okay. 
Okay. Plus five, but he's still pressed, by the way. The fact that that's safe, by the way. Stop fucking doing that, man. Reach. Insane. That's bad. What the fuck? What is that committed duck? his Wi-Fi. Okay. I believed! I fucking believed in the whole sweep! Let's go! Oh shit! <laughs> Let's go! Oh, I fucking believed in that whole sweep, man. I am not playing that guy again. <laughs> I didn't mean to accept the fucking Wi Fi, but holy shit! Oh, that's huge. Chai, Chai, you said that shit. You said that I would get it, so this is on you, man. Oh my god, Midnight Plus One, thank you for the follow. Wow, Birthday Tekka God? I'm happy with that. Well done, thank you. 